I have noticed that young people get very excited and very uh, inspired when they see artwork and when they experience art. To me, older people are re um, detached from it because they grew up in a time when there was no contact with art. So I think the younger generation of Belizeans will feel energized and feel uh, that there is something special about their country because their artists have made such amazing works of art. No? Many of the artists are, are unknown no? and many of the uh, people are, you know, they don't, most, many Belizean people, they don't have the desire to be shown. They're not like, you know, um, going out there showing people their work. So it was difficult from that perspective to kind of dig up and try and find as much as possible. Sponsored by a Dutch organization, HIVAS, the exhibition is doing another first, moving around the country. Musa hopes that as they introduce people all over the country to the show, new artists will want to sign on. The art for the people idea is not something regimented, not boxed in. We have 78 artists so far, but our intention is to, while we're moving, let's say Belmopan or San Pedro or San Pedro, Colombia for that matter, we hope to attract and add to this exhibition. So by the end, in December, we should have probably 150 rather than the 78 that we start. And that is the, the um, in a way to us, that's the exciting part. No? That the exhibit also includes archeological pieces. Musa says the difficulty he had with the Department of Archeology span trying to display the pieces was disheartening. It's not to sound critical, but they are very, um, disorganized when it comes to, to pushing for the exhibition of our Belizean artifacts. They should be the ones promoting it, no? And it's difficult for them to take it out of their hands and put it into somebody's hands because they talk about security and all these things. Mm -hmm. So that has been the biggest disappointment on my part, no? On, on the part of this project, to get the good archaeological artifacts. Because you'll go to any foreign museum and find dozens of other things, yet we can't exhibit it properly here. No? So that's ironic in many ways. No?